Kind of techie teachers here. I'm gonna show you another game I'm gonna be playing with my class today. We're gonna to do capture squares and we still haven't learned any math lessons because um, at my school we do strong start and we don't start the curriculum right away. We get to know each other. And I thought playing a game with a partner would be a great way for my students to get to know each other better. So we're gonna play stage three. And with stage three, I have my game board in a dry erase marker pouch. I have the spinner which I had these spinners in my room and I just added the numbers that go with it. And for stage three, along with the spinner, they also need number cards, which I have printed on cardstock. Um, yep, that's all we need. And so now I'm gonna show the class how to play, give them an example. Well, I'll be versing one of my students and then we'll be playing it whole class as I walk around and monitor. One last thing that I do before I present the uh, center to my class is I copy and paste some of the information of how we're going to play from the kind of techie teachers illustrative math center labels and guides and I put them into my teaching slides that way when I present it to the class they could see it nice and clear on my big whiteboard what the game board looks like how to play what are the pieces that are going to go with their game because once they get used to what goes with it in the future I won't have to do this and they'll just be able to grab the bucket and get started Put it underneath. Are you selling it? <laughs> it sounds like a monkey. 